Hello, my name is Heather Thomas, and this is my reflection video about my future in the library profession. As far as my future in this program, I hope to pursue a specialty in teen young adult librarianship or academic librarianship, so I'm very much looking forward to starting the elective classes in those fields, just to be sure that that is actually what I would like to do. Um, as far as classes go, I will probably take most of them online, but fortunately I am lucky enough to live in a suburb of Columbus, so I could take an in-person class if I needed to. Um, I think that would be a good idea to take at least one. That way, you know, I interact more than just on discussion boards with the people who are in the program with me. And as one of the readings we did for this class said, the library world is not too big, so, you know, I'll probably come across my classmates definitely in later classes, but most likely outside of class as well, and it would be good to have that kind of foundation. Um, so I hope I can take at least one in-person class during my time here. Otherwise, they'll be all online. I do have a full-time job, so... Yeah, most of it will be online after work. So anyway, um, right now, just in the two classes, they open my eyes quite a bit as to what a librarian actually does now in this new century. Most of my former library experience is just, you know, going to the library, checking out a book, maybe doing a little research for homework or a project. Um, I did work for one year at the Education Library at Indiana University. That's where I met my first master's student in the library science program. That's where I figured out that it actually was a thing that you could do. Um, and that kind of piqued my interest as, long, as well as working in the Education Library. There were a lot of library science majors, a lot of education majors, so I got to do a lot of work with them, helping them find articles, helping them find books in our stacks. So that really kind of, you know, pushed me more in the direction of pursuing this as a career. I did do linguistics as an undergrad, and that didn't really help me out after college. Any not too many undergrad linguistics jobs out there. But that's okay, because I was able to start my library science degree instead, and I think that is really what I would like to do. After school, you know, cross your fingers, it's kind of hard to get a job these days, but I hope that with the help of the people I meet through this program, the faculty and staff at Kent State, and the strength of the program, that I will be able to find something, if not right away, at least relatively quickly. I would like to either work in, like, a public library. Um, I frequent the Columbus Metropolitan Library branches quite a bit, and I would enjoy working in one of those or a similar kind of branch in another city. Um, you know, you get a lot of work with the public. You can help them find a book. You can help them research. Um, I know the libraries I go to have homework help centers. All of those are things that I would enjoy doing. I like to help people. I have experience tutoring high schoolers. I did work in a library, um, so I think that would be right up my alley. The job I have currently, I work with a lot of older people who maybe don't have the technology experience that somebody my age grew up having. So day to day, I have to help them <laughs> with the computers a lot. So I do have that background and then the classes that I am currently taking are giving me more technology knowledge and experience and then my experience helping my coworkers now, that'll help the libraries are getting very, very technology-centered these days, so that experience will definitely help with my classes and with my future as, cross your fingers, a librarian. Um, skills that I probably could go further with is the networking thing. I don't really know anybody. All of my classmates never met any of them before. I don't have like a go-to librarian. I know in the real world that, you know, I could ask for advice on classes or anything like that. So hopefully through the events through Kent State, the emails that we get about extracurriculars, programs, 
uh, conferences, that kind of thing, will help me make those connections and this classes, helping me make connections with my classmates so that when we do graduate, I'll have those also would help a great deal. Um, yeah, so I really just hope everything goes well and I don't change my mind halfway through that I don't want to do this anymore, but I don't think that will happen. <laughs>